My name is Tony Armendariz, and I'm here to talk about my painting, Ripley, which was this year's Lester J. Norris winner of the Vicinity 22 show. The story of Ripley is an interesting one. This painting goes back about five years when I took the original photos for it. I was uh, in a restaurant parking lot with my wife, and I saw this young man with a whole group of people, and they were moped enthusiasts. And it was such a wild, you know, looking group. And he was standing next to our vehicle, and I, and I thought, wow, look at him. Look at his flare and his jacket and everything. What a cool looking kid. Got out and said, hey, I want to take your picture. Thought maybe down the line it would be more of a reference for a, a painting. Don't know. A few shots of him. And actually held on to the picture, didn't revisit it for a few years. Um, until later I looked at it and go, yeah, time to do it. And the t-shirt is actually a picture of Sigourney Weaver, um, an image from one of the Alien movies. She was in four of them. This was from the second one, Aliens. And so what I decided to do was make it all about her. And so that's why you see in the picture, I kind of lopped his head off, lopped his legs off, uh, turned his glasses into sunglasses, put him in shadow, because it's really not about him at all. It's about the image. And I even made her uh, I, used a, I used a phthalo green, a color I almost never use, to make it glow. And that color was actually part of the um, coloration you saw that, it, that helped promote the movie, especially the first movie. So it, it worked out really well. Well, sure enough, uh, the painting turned out to be very successful. I've had it in multiple shows. Won a first place ward up at a show in Wisconsin. While it was there, somebody saw it, and somebody who knew the young man I took the picture of because I never got his contact information and I just thought eh, no big deal so I get this email from this guy named Tyler and he goes hey that's me turns out his friend saw the painting told him about it and nowadays he's married he's a tech guy he lives in Omaha finally I, I said you know what I'm gonna do uh, he was so nice about it wasn't asking me for any money or nothing I have made a nice 16 by 20 print send it to him I said, just send me an email with you holding the print. And I got that, and the story of Ripley lives on. 